Hello friend humans, Lucas Levy Keppel here, and this is my first vlog of a hike. I'm here at Two Rivers Trail out in uh, Sand Springs, Oklahoma, I'm just about a half hour out from Tulsa, and it's a wonderful opportunity. Uh, the day's a little overcast, but it's nice and, and cool for a summer Oklahoma day. It's like 82 Fahrenheit here. Uh, and looking forward to uh, sharing this trip with you. So I've made it a little ways along the trail so far, and I found a, a little campsite here, um, something like that. Somebody obviously uh, has used this. It's a nice thing to be able to do. I'm always a little worried when I find campfires along the, the way, though. Uh, is this a place that's going to burn down uh, the forest? Of course, with how humid it's been in Oklahoma recently, that's not likely to be a problem. So this hike's been a lot of fun so far. Not sure if I'm gonna keep going, but this is a good rest point, I think. I mean, after all, uh, it's kind of exhausting, even if it's just a little half mile. It's up and down, and there's some pricker bushes. I got stabbed by a pricker bush pretty good. Uh, you know, prefer to sit on the rock if I can, rather than on wood. I had a bad experience back in, um, in Michigan as a kid. It was, uh, camping on Mackinac Island uh, with my family. We took a little bike ride around the perimeter of the island. I don't really know how far we got. We needed to take a breather, kind of like I need to right now. And we sat down on a log and didn't think anything of it. Well, little did we know that log was a fire ant nest. And uh, I, as a wee, wee one, was covered with fire ants pretty quickly. Not the most pleasant of experiences. And I understand that with me crying and screaming and unable to ride my bike, Dad carried me back on his bike and Mom somehow shepherded my bike back to the, to the place we were staying, the campsite. <laughs> oh, what a mess. So ever since then, I won't be sitting on logs if I can help it. Uh, yeah, I know ants can be on stone too, but less likely to be in a nest than good old stone like this. Anyway, I hope this, uh, this trip's been fun for you. It's been fun for me. Getting to see Keystone Lake here. Oh, beautiful hawk. Thank you for coming. Hopefully you were in shot somewhere along the line. Oh, it is truly gorgeous.
So I don't have my main mic on, so the audio quality on this is probably going to be awful, but I wanted to show you this. This is an Osage orange. Yes, it's not the color orange. Osage is one of the, the native tribes. But I think it's cool to see those if we wander around Oklahoma. Glad to catch that on video. Well, friends, we've come to the end of the hike here, back uh, where we began. It's been wonderful to have you along with me on this uh, hike through Two Rivers Trail and the area near Keystone Dam. This is Keystone Dam here. It's one of the, uh, the dams that failed and led to massive flooding uh, along the uh, Arkansas River. I say failed, it didn't exactly fail, it was just getting up to capacity and the uh, Army Corps of Engineers didn't want it to fail, so they spilled more water than could handle. This whole area would have been underwater at that time, and uh, it's kind of hard to believe with how low the water level is now and just how, how pretty and wonderful it is to be here. Despite the humidity, it has been a great hike, and uh, thanks for coming along. If you'd like to join me on future uh, hikes, I I'm happy to bring along the camera and do some more of these vlogs. But until then, take care friend humans. I'm Lucas Levy Keppel. Mm -hmm.